No changes here. We got enough food. Increase your thrust damage with pull arms, but 10% increase your swing speed. Uh, I think the swing speed is gonna be better for us. Proper engagement? No, never. We don't need help in proper engagements. Let's put a point in athletics as well. Okay, now. We'll help out that army over there then. One's going back. I'm actually surprised that there wasn't any big empire armies coming our way. They're usually quick to react. Okay, they didn't lose that. Let's take this guy on. This is a bridge battle as well. Unfortunately, they're not across the bridge. It doesn't seem like there are. Sergeants in charge, put up. Stay close. Looks like they're behind this hill here. Take over command. Oh no, actually they're across the river. Uh, can we place our archers up here? Form a shield wall! Make a shield wall! Line formation! Forward! Forward! Hopefully they're gonna be able to shoot from there. And then again there's an invisible wall there. And here. Child the bow should this should want this one should be more accurate. Oh yeah, definitely. it up a little bit. I do still hate the fact that the enemies can just block this thing with a fucking sickle. Like, how does one do that, really? Yeah, it does. Not with the like combat module. Oh, I'm gonna with the like a combat AI module, not the combat. I'll show you which one doesn't work. Like you can check it on the mod page as well. There is a patch or an additional file you need to download to make it work, but it does. I do have it on. Dead crypt. We just finished the battle, and I'm gonna show you. One of the one of the things you get with the mod you have to turn off. Yeah, I, can, I can never remember their names. The two of them. 
There is a, actually a patch to make it work as uh, the other one work as well, but uh, it hasn't been updated in a while, so probably probably best to not use it. Could you slow? Could you slow? Shit. Keep all the loot. Actually, actually, no, let that go. Grab the horses. Okay, so you, so you want to just keep the the realistic battle AI module on, not the combat one. So the combat doesn't work, unfortunately. I'll, I'll, I mean, you can ch check if it works with the like uh, fix for it that the mother made with us, but um, I don't think it will because it's being updated all the time. I would say don't use that on like any mod that actually changes the troops around as well or adds armor or anything in the game. I was thinking of using it though, but that way it doesn't work. Or it m might crash the game all the time. I didn't lose anyone in that battle, nice. Right, let's join these guys in the siege. Hmm. Okay, so the Empire is returning to fight us. I like how scatter just means fucking loose formation for them. Guy is aiming at me. Okay, maybe two of them. Looks like they're only gonna camp the the ridge up there. Sh there should be that should actually work out in our favor. We have a clear shot of them. Instant block, Jesus Christ, or parry, whatever the fuck it is. Let's move our shit up. Horsemen, sergeants in charge. So bad the skirmishing. The fuck is that? Wow. 
the hell are my skirmishers? Behind the hill? Why wouldn't they be behind the hill? <laughs> well, like I have like one cav guy trying to beat their own. This mod is pain in the ass. This is like on the easiest, like combat AI difficulty, whatever the fuck it is. This man doesn't have a shield. see how well we do even though they're all gonna turn to face me uh, if you mean the Tessagen faction you can just uh, like there's a culture thing you can pick for them you just need to scroll down a little bit when you're making a character and it will show up and you do start in the Ezrai territory but you can join them I think that mod that actually lets you like join the, or be in a faction as a king or something can work with us. Should be able to work with us. I think we're gonna hit clan level 2 after this as well, so we're gonna join the faction. I do need to install the culture changing mod as well. Because otherwise going back to recruit the Tessogen units is gonna be a pain in the ass. So we'll give these these to the troops as well. I, th I think you start the if you pick the Desergen culture, start here. I think something like that, like here or here. Then you need to make your way over there and join the faction. I think we're clan level. Yes, we are. Okay, now we can join the faction. Normal. No more still. I got one free attribute point. Um, let's place it into social. There is a mod that. Um, the version of the mod that doesn't add the settlements in so it's like more compatible with all other mods if you're using them i guess you can do that as well yeah i think the empire is just gonna come at us at this point with the, the full force of all their armies This guy is chasing me. Well, no, I'm the one who chases. Sergeant, 
I'm never gonna get used to the Empire having like a skirmish cap, man. Is gonna block. No, 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 no. I'm not like the fucking skirmishers, man. on this is almost perfect I mean it's like a uh, bit of a speed let's kill these guys they call me the arrow dodger of course he's alive Trees are gonna get me killed as well. Turn around, come on. There we go. Seven kills. Ah, sure. We need a engineer either way. So let's make him engineer smithing and tactics. I guess engineer smithing and tactics. to keep in mind Russian engine no range siege engine and build speed non range siege engine and build speed we don't need that range siege engines have time to spend more hit points yes carpenter and siege towers have more uh, HP let's go for more ammunition increase the hit chance of siege engines by 10% during campaign siege Damage to walls increased. Definitely that one. Uh, and smithing. Mm, let's go with charcoal. Can you find two units of iron and two units of steel and one unit of crude iron as a byproduct? No. 
Double the chance of learning new crafting parts through smithing. Character can refine two units of steel into a one unit of fine steel. You have a 10% chance to create a fine weapon if the difficulty requires requirements are met. And we need to do the, those ones manually. I think the battle here started as well. So let's join in. Hmm. Which weapon do we keep? I don't think we want this in a siege battle. Even I don't even have that much health. Well, let's see what we can do. So we got we just got the bathroom ram which is gonna suck ass for us no oh, that speed is gonna be important for like uh just this bit here. from in here shooting me. What? There we go. This guy in this window? Yes, there is. Not anymore. Isn't he? Tell which ones are ours. There's only six enemies left. Come on. There we go. Get some reinforcements as well. Nice. Yaru. Grab all of these.
No, really, this is a sword. I think we got the best armor in the game so far. More or less. Get the rest of the troops. Of course, we can't. Limit exceeded, and there's only 22 prisoners in there. Come on, game. I don't think we're getting that. So, influence from battles definitely is the way to go. The game should auto pick these. Hmm. Well, well enough, we're the only one expanding it. Well, the Valandians have, have that, but we're the only ones so far expanding into the Empire territory. Oh, speak of the devil. They're besieging Ulsan Castle. So that army from there is going all the way over there. Makes sense. Good. Well, let them go over there. We got to hunt down more enemy lords, possibly. Right, we can also join the... We need to talk to the king, I think. Uh, can I can I tag him? No, we can just send him a message right. Much easier. Let's keep these so we can dump them for, from, for influence. Gonna get some units and some stuff from him as well. Okay, so that's the exact same container we do have. Wait, what? Why the. Used? What the f. Well, of course it's going to be used. I think they like the armor and stuff in the Japanese culture was handed down, just like the katana and everything else. I do want to see if we can make this work. So I'm going to save and exit here. And then we're going to do a live check if the mod works, changing culture mod works. Bear with me for a little bit while I go download it. Track mods. Oh, good, I've been all logged out. Perfect. Changing culture. Let's see. And a certain time, from time to time, when requirement is met. The, okay, this each campaign will start. We'll have a respective XML fire a clan and settlement culture unloaded when start the campaign. If you want the mod to work with other custom mods, then you need to read cultural volunteer section. Ah, eh, shit. Uh, 
Um, I'm gonna need to do this off screen. Or off stream as well. Might take it a little bit of finagling to get it work. We have to edit XML files. I'm not the best of that. We're gonna be, we're gonna have to go back each time to recruit some troops. Which that's gonna be a bigger problem once you actually start having uh, companions going around because they're not gonna have any Tetsujin troops with them. Samurai troops. Yeah, we're almost at part capacity, don't have to go back just yet. I go with these ones. Plus, uh, anything we take can actually, you know, try and hold. It's not gonna work well to, for us. Can rebel in no time. Let's see if I can lure one of these guys into me. Okay, this guy actually wants to fight. Army is just melted the archers at this point. Archers. Let's place the archers here. Stream behind him. And this fucking rock in front of us is gonna, is gonna get us killed. Oh, I didn't switch weapons. Oh, this is gonna be bad. This guy has a bunch of calves as well. out for us since we do a lot of our infantry well all of our infantry has like la uh, well not uh spears or pikes this should work for us if their cab actually charges us I can't believe I got that hit in Sort of he has like uh, the Yari on him. Okay, this is a little bit fierce for the What is the AI doing? I 
I mean, if they're just gonna keep moving their cav as, as archers into us. That might actually work because then the... My guys, when they're braced, they're not gonna have momentum to kill these guys. Can I mind that? They're charged again. Looks like I need more infantry, right? Shields block things, remember? Yeah, I have GB stairs easily. Plus the Umbar consoles have maces with them. So they should be doing well against their infantry. still have a bunch of infantry running around. Okay, not the infantry cav. Damn this, yeah. A katana is short, who would have thought, right? Come on, come on, attack me, come on. Oh, no, no, don't, don't, don't run away. for message on Steam. Okay, only one loss on our side. Look at that. We're doing pretty well. One guy died on our side, making can loot his corpse. Get them levels up. Let's 
what's the difference here? Uh, so 13 to bows, that's the only difference. Oh, let's grab a couple of uh, on the moment foot. And then run away from that army. We don't want to fight them. There was another lord here we can hunt down. Another point. Let's put it pole arms. Pull arms. I do want to switch my weapons before I forget. Again. Alright, we can sell one of these. With the Yari. The Nakamaki. The ones we have, want to go with. Range in these guys. Jesus. So we can uh, place our archers behind the infantry. This one, since it's downhill. Enough of you guys. I do need to start looking at the tournaments so because one of them might actually have the uh, faster horse on them. Can't remember which one it was. Even the shield actually blocks the melee hit as well with the mod on. I don't know which which part of your name to pronounce. Sapori. Let's go with that. What's up? this game? Well, did you love the first one? The Warband? Do you still like Warband a little bit better than this? Or maybe that's just because Prophecy of Pandora is still on it. Zero losses? Come on, come on. There we go, nice. Look at that, there's some extra troops as well. Uh, let's go for the highest tier ones, of course. that many so it's not gonna matter much an Italian name 
really long Italian name. Funny though. I always find it funny that like the normal like enemy troops get to fi fancy armor like masterwork, fine steel, whatever the fuck that is. Right, maybe I could actually kit myself out as well. When, uh, you know, civilian clothes. See what we can get. Not much, actually. Let's put this back on. Just grab the weapon. Um, we survived something. I'm not sure what exactly. The first one is that A with the thing above it, it's, it's S, right? Jose, v Vitor. Saraiva, Sapori. Of course, I'm not Italian, so I'm going to... Ooh, look at this, an army in the making. Let's kill it. You're a tall motherfucker. Oh shit. Didn't notice I was uh, wounded there. But he has a ton of our troops, so that kind of works out. And a bowmaster. And a bowmaster. Okay, that's all we can take. Now the music is making me want to play uh, Shogun, that's for sure. I might actually do it. Who knows? I don't have the DLCs though. Yeah, this can actually be used as a civilian weapon. Alright, let's uh, give this to the troops. Let's not use these ones. Got a little upgrade for our legs though. Ah, oh, flag better. No, no way, no how. Worst idea ever. Alright, maybe I should check that we have a herd. No, we do not yet. Yeah, we're still fine. Look at the amount of influence we still we got already. Nice. Now I do wanna like go and uh, dump the prisoners. I mean, where we're gonna get influence? We're gonna need a lot of it. So let's. I mean, we, there shouldn't be any prisoners over there. Shouldn't. Let's see what happens. Plus, we need to replenish our troops. Why did I actually place this guy? No, I did not. Yeah, make him the engineer. I want to make a companion that's gonna lead another party. So once we actually like uh, destroy an enemy army like that that has a bunch of our guys prisoners. 
dungeon, donate prisoners. Yes, we can. Nice. Okay, so 50. That's 100, man. Oh, no, never mind. It's not. Uh, let's join the tournament. I don't think this is the horse we want, but anyway, let's try and win it. Okay, for once I'm not mad I'm getting the bow. He really hit me with a the kunai there. He's too erratic. Then I'm gonna use the skirmisher, right? Oh, there we go. Another hit. And the killing blow. We got the shurikens this time around. Doing is feeling that high up down. The fuck is that supposed to be? Oh, that's the Umbar console. to her and to him as well yeah this mod actually like tells you to use the tournament to mo uh, mods that fi the mods that fix the tournament so it's like a little bit more fair because these guys are so heavily armored it's not even funny Take a while. You might actually kill me here. That was close. Okay, let's be smart about this one. Let's uh, make him waste his uh, shuriken. See if that's the horse we wanted. Mm. 
Not really. It's kind of better than this tapi horse. And it's considered a mount, not a war mount as well. That's weird. Well, let's, uh, let's see. Permanent Nagamaki. Alright, we should go to the smithy. Not me. You. Cut damage 108. Length is uh, what is the length? Weapon reach 161. What about with this? This definitely has less cut damage. Triple fine katana blade. It's weird you can mix all these, because they're not the same type of weapon. Not at all. The cut damage is a hun above 100, it seems, for all of these, more or less. 152 here for the Fine Katana Blade, though. We can make some really cheap weapons with us. Cheap as in uh, they're gonna do a shitload of damage. Let's go to the pole arms. this a hundred and ninety two damage Yari blade weapon reach almost 500 540 yeah look at that 195 Yeah, we're gonna make, gonna be, we have to make some of these so we can like, do a shitload of more damage. Let's see if we put a great sword. We don't actually want something that can hit uh, that with that much range. We want something shorter. So we can actually make this. Look at that. Nice. Doesn't do that much damage though. Let's see about the katanas. Go with that one. Or the noble guard. And up. Uh, and armor. <laughs> 